Local leaders gathered here at the Baxter Community Center in West Louisville this morning to talk about how the program called ReImage will work. They even had a success story to share. Um, I was hanging with the wrong group at once, and uh, I started seeing friends and family members going downhill, dying, ending up in jail, and I didn't want to be like that. 18 year old Chase Haskins was facing a misdemeanor charge when he was connected with the program ReImage. So we worked with Chase on, on job skills, uh, on resume writing and on, on interviewing skills. He got an interview, then a job offer. Now he's setting bigger goals. I want to be a homicide detective because uh, I like helping people. These young people, through hard work and dedication, can be examples to their friends and to their family. 100 young adults facing misdemeanor charges will be picked to join the program. The bottom line is that some folks do make a mistakes and they do step back and it's up to us to say come on let's move forward here together let's not repeat those mistakes. That's where community volunteers come in as mentors guiding the young adults through challenges they may be facing. Like uh, where am I going to live? Where do I get the food on the table? Where do I get the clothes on my back? It could be that I've had an addiction uh, problem. I'm struggling with the parenthood issue. Only people between the ages of 18 and 24 will be recruited. Almost 50 percent of the victims of this year's shootings have been people 25 years old or younger. Nearly 20 percent of this year's homicide victims fall under that same age group. LMPD Chief Steve Conrad says giving them tools to succeed will help prevent crime. We are not going to arrest our way out of our problems here in this community already this year. We've arrested over 25,000 people. $200,000 have been earmarked in the city budget for the program. Erica Coghill, WLKY News.